Despite being a relatively common sight in the woods and wetlands of Connecticut, snapping turtles still hold many questions for researchers. They spend almost their entire lives underwater and rarely come onto land and, and we don't have access to that world. Thanks to Mystic Aquarium and National Geographic Critter Cam inventor Greg Marshall, Dr. Tobias Landberg is getting a unique perspective on the underwater world of the snapping turtle. Every single critter cam system is designed very specifically for the animal that we're deploying on. And so the, for the snapping turtle, we had to come up with a very specific mechanism to make sure that it was done appropriately. All right, sweetheart, let's go for a ride. We've actually undergone uh, an evolution. The first time we did it, we attached the critter cam using paper mache, and we actually glued it onto the shell. And then we put the camera in the water and let the turtle go and the paper mache dissolved and the camera floated off. Now the system has evolved such that we can uh, attach it with fishing line. A couple of very gentle passive hooks that just slip on the edges, the margins of the shell and that are held together by, by, by a rubber band in the middle. And there's actually a computer that inside the critter cam that cuts the cable when at the exact moment uh, that we're ready for to have it release and then it just detaches and, and uh, floats up to the surface. Monday's Critter Cam deployment at the Tributary Mill Conservancy in Old Lyme had a young audience including fifth graders from the sales school in Baltic. What we hope is happening is that we're inspiring some uh, in inquiry into and curiosity in the natural world. Everybody wish this turtle well. I think it's critical. Um, without, without a sense of curiosity, uh, you can't ask good questions. And without good questions, uh, you can't do good science. So this is the stage and, uh, of, of the research project and, and of these uh, young scientists' life where it's the sort of embryonic stage where, where inquisitiveness and new questions arise.